In this video, I'm going to show you how to bring files from your machine to any door for collaboration or mixing purposes. Let's get it. Now there are three levels to exporting files in machine. So the first level is to export your audio sample from your sound slot. The second level is to export your audio stems of the song. And the third level is to export MIDI information out of a machine to your door. So let's check that out in Machine and Logic Pro. Let's go. Okay, so the first tier of exporting audio in machine is basically exporting your drum samples. Over here, I have a kit that has a kick, snare, head, close and head open. If you were to sample it, you can hear it right now. The reason why I put the MIDI notes like this, regardless of the pattern length, is because I want to export these as a individual MIDI note. Now, if I were to go to the arrangement view and I add a scene, which is scene three, and if I were to play it, what we want to do is to get the stems out from this sound. And I'm just going to click Command E on my keyboard and it says export song as audio. Instead of exporting the master, I want to export the sounds within the group. The option here on the source, I go to sound. I'll just check the drums, which is all four sounds within here. You just want the sample itself. So I'm gonna just go ahead and just export this, find the folder under drum samples, and then I export it. And with that one click, if I were to open my folder, you can see all my drum samples are here. So I have four of these samples now in WAV format. So what I can do next is if I want to collaborate with someone on Logic Pro using the Drum Machine Designer, let me just pull up Logic Pro. And here we have a Drum Designer Kit. What you can do is just drag and drop all your kits in here. There you go. Now you have your Drum Machine Designer with all the samples that you exported out of machine. So if you were to play it, I'm going to just go back to where my scene is. I'll just go to scene one where I have my drum kit pattern. So I have the kick, snare, heads, close and open, all arranged within this pattern. Let's have a listen. So all you can do right now is you can head over to the side of the machine here. You see these two buttons here. This is the MIDI export file. So when you click on it, you can actually drag it to your folder. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my MIDI patterns folder and I'm just going to drag this into the folder. Now this MIDI pattern, then you can actually drag it into your drum machine designer in Logic. So let's open up and export it in. I know these are all the instruments that comes with it because Logic is reading these instruments with the MIDI notes that is exported in. You can always delete these instruments and then you can always drag this to the top of where your drums are all imported. So yes, the pattern is there, but you still need to edit some of the samples that are within it because the root note might be on a different root note. So you can actually change the root key here. Usually it's on C3. So click onto your drum sample and type C3, C3, everything is C3 and let's play it. Simple as that, just drag and drop. Let me just create two audio tracks just for the next part of the tutorial, which is exporting your stems of your song. I have audio one out of two, I'm just going to mute this drum kit and we are going back into machine. All right, so we have this arrangement in our song and we will want to have this arrangement exported as individual stems. Now in machine, there are two types of export, which is the group and the sound like we mentioned earlier. So when I press command E, make sure the range is under all. So you're exporting the whole stem of the song itself. I want to export the group of the drums. So it's just a one flat wave file for the drums and one flat wave file for the synth itself. And I export them. In Logic itself, you have your two audio tracks. Say one is for your drums and one is for your synth. So I'm going to just drag those audio samples that we just exported 
Let me just put it here. All right, so if I were to play it, it'll sound exactly the same like we did in Machine itself. So let's have a listen. Now, this is a combined group of sounds within one audio file. So let's have a look at having them as individual WAV files, okay? So I'm gonna create five tracks. So I'll just say this will be the kick, this is the snare, and this is hat one, hat two, the synth, okay? Back to where my machine is. I'm going to export this whole arrangement as individual files. So what I can do is I export audio again, which is command E. I'll just go to sounds and make sure drum is checked everything. Synth is checked as well. And I'll just do this as song stems 2 and I'll just export. Now we go back to logic and we just drag those samples in. I have all my five audio samples and I just drag it in. We have all the individual drums and the synth itself. So let's play it. Now I said in the tutorial earlier, I do have a machine and logic pro template. It's available for $1 on my Kofi page. You guys can go support that by the link in my description below. Otherwise, if you guys want to learn how to do that, I'm going to leave the video instructions up here. I'm Vibe Synthetic once again, and if you guys really like this video, remember to smash that like button, hit the subscribe on my channel, and also turn on the post notification bell button. Be sure to check out my machine videos that I'll leave towards the end of the screen. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Peace.